Hello, my name is Marius Cumming, and together with the Footy Almanac, we're raising funds to renovate the grave of this man, Tom Wills, Australia's first sporting superstar and father of Australian football. After a tragic end to his extraordinary life, Tom Wills was laid to rest at an anonymous gravesite, the Melbourne Cricket Club funding the gravestone long after his death. The inscription, founder of Australian football and champion cricketer of his time, erected by public subscription, sponsored by the MCC. As you can see from the broken railing, cracked, mouldy concrete and faded lettering, it needs a renovation and we have the blessing of the Wills family to do so. Its current state does not befit our first sporting legend. Tom Wills grew up in a pioneering family alongside the Aboriginal people of Moyston in Western Victoria. Then, as a young man, a world away at rugby school in England, he stunned the cricketing hierarchy with his brilliant skill. Upon his return to Australia, he became the toast of the Victorian colony with his match-winning bowling. But in 1858, wanting to keep cricketers fit over the winter, he organised and trialled a new game of what he called football. The following year, the first rules of the Melbourne Football Club were documented. T.W. Wills appears as the first signature of this very significant document. Fostering the game's earliest years, Tom Wills helped establish the very first football clubs. And then, at 26, the height of his fame, he left it all to join his ambitious father Horatio establish a 200,000 acre sheep station in remote central Queensland. Two weeks after their arrival, local Aborigines massacred 19 of the white settlers on the station, including Horatio. Having travelled to fetch supplies two days away, Tom returned to a horrific scene. A shattered man, he carried on his father's dream, but it wasn't him. He returned to Victoria a few years later and, in a truly remarkable move, formed an Aboriginal cricket team from Western Victoria. Having grown up and played with the local Aboriginals as a boy, Tom found it easy to coach this talented team, which went on to play on the MCG against the Melbourne Cricket Club in 1866. The team is shown here in front of the then MCC pavilion. The team later was the first Australian cricket team to tour England. But the most remarkable aspect is that Tom formed and nurtured this team just five years after his own father was killed in Queensland. A truly amazing thing to do. But that was Tom Wills, enigmatic, flamboyant, controversial and fiercely egalitarian. Despite his own tragic death by his own hand at just 44, Tom Wills created a game Australians can call their own, enjoyed now by millions every year. He was the first inductee into the AFL Hall of Fame. So, let's do the right thing by Tom. Please donate what you can to restore his grave via the Oz Crowd funding site. Thank you.